Hi, I'm Charlene from Sato UK and today I'm going to take you through a couple of the retail solutions that Sato have to offer. I'm going to take you through the Sato production management system. This is a solution based on the Sato FX3 printer and optimising its usability from label printing to production planning. This is ideal for in a bakery environment, somewhere where you need to log your production and optimise what you have on the shelf against what you're wasting each night. So we start by, you print a pick slip. So this is basically telling the, the user what do they need to remove from the freezer. You do that, you go into the bakery plan and you could have various different categories in terms of daily items, cookies, muffins um, and so forth. So we're going to print the daily items just to give you an example. So we print that item out and in this production plan it's optimised from sales data, previous sales data and wastage that's been recorded from the POS. So this has printed out your pick slip. Once those items are removed from the oven, um, you're going to log that production just to clarify what you have actually baked and what's going to go on the, on the shop floor. So you go into your log production. We go to daily items and we're going to advise the printer that we have baked these items. For the first bake, it was automatically put what was on your pick slip. And if there's not enough of one particular item because there is no stock in the freezer, you would just amend that accordingly. But today we're just gonna say, yep, we produce those items and they are logged for production purposes. Once logged, the uh, screen will go green just to say that a log has been made. If then later on during the day you want to produce more, you would then go back into that and re-log it again and that, then that can record multiple logs. Okay, so aside from the bakery planning, you would then be able to print your normal product labels um, just by going into print labels, go to your various categories that you need, select the item that you want, it will then give you a layout format of the label, what it looks like, all the product details, the price. You can change the quantity to what you want to print. Just amend that and print your labels. You can then apply those to the products and they are ready to be put on the shop floor. So at the end of the day, um, you can also then record wastage on the Sato printer. So in order to do that, you would just go back to your main screen and go to the wastage report. It's the same kind of principle as logging a production. You would go into your, your items, say we have, for example, on this one, um, almond croissants, we've got two left. We would just select that item, change the quantity to two, confirm, and then confirm that wastage. The data is then stored on the printer. It can either be stored locally or it can go to the cloud using the Sato app storage. We can then use the POS data and the wastage data to calculate and optimise production planning moving forward. This is a, a unique solution that can then make each store individual product plans so that it can optimise sales and reduce wastage. So I'm going to go through the mobile printer, the PW2. This printer is light, small, compact and very robust. It has an 8 feet drop test, double moulded edges and it comes with a shoulder strap or a belt clip. If you're looking to reduce wastage and improve efficiency, the mobile printing solution would be ideal for you. You'd be able to scan an item. The item's details would then appear on your handheld terminal with discount levels if you wanted to change them. If not, you would then just select your quantity and print your labels accordingly. On this solution, I'm gonna show you Thermochromic Ink. This is ideal for highlighting specific information that needs to be in a different colour, such as price, allergen information and so forth. On this application we have a shelf edge ticket highlighting the price, allergen details and also given the product information. What's happened on this shelf edge label is when we've produced it in our factory here at Sato UK, we have laid out the plates to indicate where thermochromic ink should be. So it would be a clear to red, clear to back, clear to orange and so forth. Using thermochromic ink, we can image different areas of the label in different colours. So that's all from me today at Sato UK. If you'd like to learn more about our solutions outside of the three that I've just demonstrated today, please drop me a message and come and see our showroom.